Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am back with a brand new video and this is um, quite different than any that I've ever done before and that I'm doing it outside. So just want to do a, just a, a little quick win and just with the change of scenery. Um, there have been a lot of changes in my life since I last done a f figure uh, review video. So just trying out some new things and let me know what you think. Um, so right here we have Rey Mysterio um, Series 124 uh, basic figure. I was looking for this figure figure for quite a while and finally came across it about maybe a month ago um, at a Walmart in the Eden area so I was extremely glad to find this one I'm a huge Mysterio fan and his basics are always some of the best looking ones and I love basic figures anyway so we're just gonna get into this and see what it's all about and of course as you can see from the box you have Ray Mysterio and his um kind of a lime and gray uh, attire with the GOAT um, acronym and he certainly is one of the GOATs in wrestling history in my estimation and on the back we can see the other members of the figures included in this series which were Seth Rollins, Angel Garza, Io Shirai, and Kyle O'Reilly And, and now getting into the figures, we can see um, very good feeling figure. The lime green definitely stands out. I mean, Ray's always one of the more, I mean, his outfits, his his ring attire, that's a better way to put his ring attire is always top tier. You just never know what colors or combinations you're going to see him in. Um, this is a very strong figure, and I like Ray figures because... As with most of the basics, that they're true to the size of the wrestler. Being that Rey Mysterio is one of the smaller wrestlers on the roster, it would make sense that his figure is not as big as, say, a Drew McIntyre or a, I'm trying to think of another big wrestler or a, a Otis or someone of that stature. And we see the, um, we're looking at his arm, you have many tattoos, um, you have a cool ray with a crown kind of armband, and I like the special touch, like the little tassels from it, very good um, detailed tattoo work. And of course, the shirt with the greatest of all time, the GOAT acronym. You see Ray with a very expressive, happy face, um, like the gray and, and even just the back of the mask. I mean, just from the head and the, the that kind of stripe going down the back, very impressive. And then on the other arm, you have the um, the question mark, M and question mark for, I believe that's a question mark for, you know, Mysterio, being the man of mystery that he is. More tattoos on the side and this is the left well my left side you have the ray 619 with some black um, kind of in yellow lettering with some black uh diagonal thick stripes behind it then you have the two red question marks on um on the side and then the other side you have the goat acronym again and the lime green boots and overall, this is just a very good looking figure. It just feels great in my hands, very sturdy. And if you uh, watch any of my videos, you know I'm a huge proponent of the basic series figures. You know, elites are great and all, and I have tons and tons of elites but you know these basics are just to me they you know a lot of times they stand out even the more so i can just open these up and you know these are just figures you can really get to work with so i'm um, definitely loving this figure glad that i found it in the wild i love when i can find figures instead of in the store instead of having to you know order them from ringside collectibles or uh, amazon or ebay so i definitely consider this a win um ray mysterio jr well, he's known as Rey Mysterio in WWE, but Rey Mysterio, Series 124. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Definitely leave a comment, like it, subscribe. Let me know what you think of the outdoor setting, because if you like it, I may be doing more of these. And I may be doing more of these anyway, though, because I'm trying to really get through a couple of videos in a quick amount of time. So uh, like, just let me know what you think. Definitely um, hit me up on Instagram at JD Collectible, where you can see more of my collection of wrestling figures and other, you know, wrestling paraphernalia and anime merchandise and things of that nature definitely follow me on there and let's keep the conversation going so hope you've enjoyed this video and i will see you again after a while